guys, I'm going to show you the tail end of this plane. Um, I am printed out one of those cone uh, motor mounts and I cut the area out so that you can fit the cone motor mount in there. And I will add on the screen the measurements of that cone motor mount. But uh, we did that and then we glued that cone in there. First we mo mounted the motor to it, but then we glued the cone in and it's a snug fit. This is a 2216, 2200 KV. Yo, 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 what's up Thrill Seekers? Back at it again. And we are back working on the Kopaki wing. We did our third motor swap. Our first motor swap was the 2216 uh, 1120 KV motor, and that was not enough on 3S. We took that off. We put a 2306 1400 KV motor, and that was pretty decent, but not quite good enough. So now we have a 2216 2200 KV motor. This is the same motor that is used on the Zod Alpha Strike. We have the exact same motor, that blue motor off the Alpha Strike, and we have it on the Kopaki wing. But that's not even the craziest part. I had an idea that you know that you can run the Run Cam 2 as an FPV camera. Not know also that you could run the Run Cam 5 as an FPV camera. Let me switch this around. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about. Here. All right, so here we are. I took off that stubby antenna and we have a foldable dipole antenna fold it down for transportation use or whatever flip it back up we are going to try the dipole out i like i like this dipole style antenna i usually use the little tiny ones but we'll try this out and see what happens but this is the run cam 5 and i use the same connector on the side check it out guys look at that it shows you how much uh, record time you have left. It shows you that you have a power connected and it shows you that you're on uh, 1080p. Check it out. We have five hours of record time available. You see that? Five hours of record time. <laughs> this is crazy. I didn't know that you could FPV with this one. Might have to get a couple more of these. These are way more efficient than the Run Camp 2. Plus, I already had the Velcro on there. I may um, use a different strap. I don't know if I trust the Velcro on this or not. But I already had the Velcro on there. And bada boom, bada bing, it works. <laughs> 